to Sound Bites Academy. Let's talk about magic. Have you ever seen a magic show before? They're so entertaining. Yes, I saw one in Las Vegas last year, and it was mind blowing. Have you ever seen a magic show before? They're so entertaining. Yes, I saw one in Las Vegas last year, and it was mind blowing. Have you ever seen a magic show before? They're so entertaining. Yes, I saw one in Las Vegas last year, and it was mind blowing. Have you ever seen a magic show before? They're so entertaining. Yes, I saw one in Las Vegas last year, and it was mind blowing. I'm practicing a new card trick. Do you want to see it? Sure, I'd love to see it. I'm practicing a new card trick. Do you want to see it? Sure, I'd love to see it. I'm practicing a new card trick. Do you want to see it? Sure, I'd love to see it. I'm practicing a new card trick. Do you want to see it? Sure, I'd love to see it. What's your favorite type of magic trick? I love watching illusions that involve disappearing acts. They're always so mesmerizing. What's your favorite type of magic trick? I love watching illusions that involve disappearing acts. They're always so mesmerizing. What's your favorite type of magic trick? I love watching illusions that involve disappearing acts. They're always so mesmerizing. What's your favorite type of magic trick? I love watching illusions that involve disappearing acts. They're always so mesmerizing. How do you think magicians perform their tricks? Do you believe in real magic, or is it all just sleight of hand? How do you think magicians perform their tricks? Do you believe in real magic, or is it all just sleight of hand? How do you think magicians perform their tricks? Do you believe in real magic, or is it all just sleight of hand? How do you think magicians perform their tricks? Do you believe in real magic, or is it all just sleight of hand? My uncle is a professional magician, and he's teaching me some new tricks. I can't wait to show them off. My uncle is a professional magician, and he's teaching me some new tricks. I can't wait to show them off. My uncle is a professional magician, and he's teaching me some new tricks. I can't wait to show them off. My uncle is a professional magician, and he's teaching me some new tricks. I can't wait to show them off. Have you ever tried performing a magic trick? It takes a lot of practice to get it right. Have you ever tried performing a magic trick? It takes a lot of practice to get it right. Have you ever tried performing a magic trick? It takes a lot of practice to get it right. Have you ever tried performing a magic trick? It takes a lot of practice to get it right. I heard that the famous magician David Copperfield is touring again. I would love to see his show live. I heard that the famous magician David Copperfield is touring again. I would love to see his show live. 
I heard that the famous magician David Copperfield is touring again. I would love to see his show live. I heard that the famous magician David Copperfield is touring again. I would love to see his show live. What's the most impressive magic trick you've ever seen? I saw a magician sawing a person in half once, and I still can't figure out how he did it. What's the most impressive magic trick you've ever seen? I saw a magician sawing a person in half once, and I still can't figure out how he did it. What's the most impressive magic trick you've ever seen? I saw a magician sawing a person in half once, and I still can't figure out how he did it. What's the most impressive magic trick you've ever seen? I saw a magician sawing a person in half once, and I still can't figure out how he did it. Do you think there's a certain personality type that makes for a good magician? I think it takes a lot of confidence, showmanship, and creativity to be a great magician. Do you think there's a certain personality type that makes for a good magician? I think it takes a lot of confidence, showmanship, and creativity to be a great magician. Do you think there's a certain personality type that makes for a good magician? I think it takes a lot of confidence, showmanship, and creativity to be a great magician. Do you think there's a certain personality type that makes for a good magician? I think it takes a lot of confidence, showmanship, and creativity to be a great magician. I love watching magic on TV, but I bet it's even better in person. Have you been to a live magic show before? I love watching magic on TV, but I bet it's even better in person. Have you been to a live magic show before? I love watching magic on TV, but I bet it's even better in person. Have you been to a live magic show before? I love watching magic on TV. But I bet it's even better in person. Have you been to a live magic show before? Have you ever watched the movie, The Prestige? It's a great film about two rival magicians. Have you ever watched the movie, The Prestige? It's a great film about two rival magicians. Have you ever watched the movie, The Prestige? It's a great film about two rival magicians. Have you ever watched the movie, The Prestige? It's a great film about two rival magicians. My friend's birthday party is coming up, and I want to perform a magic show for her. Any suggestions on what tricks to include? My friend's birthday party is coming up, and I want to perform a magic show for her. Any suggestions on what tricks to include? My friend's birthday party is coming up, and I want to perform a magic show for her. Any suggestions on what tricks to include? My friend's birthday party is coming up, and I want to perform a magic show for her. Any suggestions on what tricks to include? I've always been fascinated by the art of illusion. It's amazing how magicians can manipulate our senses and perceptions. I've always been fascinated by the art of illusion. It's amazing how magicians can manipulate our senses and perceptions. I've always been fascinated by the art of illusion. It's amazing how magicians can manipulate our senses and perceptions. I've always been fascinated by the art of illusion. It's amazing how magicians can manipulate our senses and perceptions.
What's the difference between a magic trick and an illusion? I think an illusion is a more complex type of magic trick that involves more elaborate setups. What's the difference between a magic trick and an illusion? I think an illusion is a more complex type of magic trick that involves more elaborate setups. What's the difference between a magic trick and an illusion? I think an illusion is a more complex type of magic trick that involves more elaborate setups. What's the difference between a magic trick and an illusion? I think an illusion is a more complex type of magic trick that involves more elaborate setups. Have you ever seen a street magician perform? They're so talented and can make magic happen in the most unexpected places. Have you ever seen a street magician perform? They're so talented and can make magic happen in the most unexpected places. Have you ever seen a street magician perform? They're so talented and can make magic happen in the most unexpected places. Have you ever seen a street magician perform? They're so talented and can make magic happen in the most unexpected places. Do you believe that some magic tricks are dangerous or risky? Definitely, some tricks require a lot of skill and precision, and one wrong move can lead to injury. Do you believe that some magic tricks are dangerous or risky? Definitely, some tricks require a lot of skill and precision, and one wrong move can lead to injury. Do you believe that some magic tricks are dangerous or risky? Definitely, some tricks require a lot of skill and precision, and one wrong move can lead to injury. Do you believe that some magic tricks are dangerous or risky? Definitely, some tricks require a lot of skill and precision, and one wrong move can lead to injury. I've been reading up on the history of magic and it's fascinating how it dates back to ancient civilizations. I've been reading up on the history of magic, and it's fascinating how it dates back to ancient civilizations. I've been reading up on the history of magic, and it's fascinating how it dates back to ancient civilizations. I've been reading up on the history of magic, and it's fascinating how it dates back to ancient civilizations. I'm attending a magic workshop this weekend. It's a great opportunity to learn from experienced magicians. I'm attending a magic workshop this weekend. It's a great opportunity to learn from experienced magicians. I'm attending a magic workshop this weekend. It's a great opportunity to learn from experienced magicians. I'm attending a magic workshop this weekend. It's a great opportunity to learn from experienced magicians. What's the most unusual or bizarre magic trick you've ever seen? I saw a magician swallow a sword once, and it was both impressive and terrifying. What's the most unusual or bizarre magic trick you've ever seen? I saw a magician swallow a sword once, and it was both impressive and terrifying. What's the most unusual or bizarre magic trick you've ever seen? I saw a magician swallow a sword once, and it was both impressive and terrifying. What's the most unusual or bizarre magic trick you've ever seen? I saw a magician swallow a sword once, and it was both impressive and terrifying. How do you think magicians come up with their trick ideas? I think they draw inspiration from everyday objects and situations, and then add their own unique twist to it. 
How do you think magicians come up with their trick ideas? I think they draw inspiration from everyday objects and situations, and then add their own unique twist to it. How do you think magicians come up with their trick ideas? I think they draw inspiration from everyday objects and situations, and then add their own unique twist to it. How do you think magicians come up with their trick ideas? I think they draw inspiration from everyday objects and situations, and then add their own unique twist to it. I'm trying to create my own magic trick for a talent show. It's a lot harder than it looks. I'm trying to create my own magic trick for a talent show. It's a lot harder than it looks. I'm trying to create my own magic trick for a talent show. It's a lot harder than it looks. I'm trying to create my own magic trick for a talent show. It's a lot harder than it looks. Have you ever watched the TV show, Penn and Teller? Fool us. It's a great show where magicians perform tricks to try and fool the famous duo. Have you ever watched the TV show, Penn and Teller, Fool Us? It's a great show where magicians perform tricks to try and fool the famous duo. Have you ever watched the TV show, Penn and Teller, Fool Us? It's a great show where magicians perform tricks to try and fool the famous duo. Have you ever watched the TV show, Penn and Teller, Fool Us? It's a great show where magicians perform tricks to try and fool the famous duo. I'm planning to visit a magic museum next month. It has a huge collection of props and memorabilia from famous magicians throughout history. I'm planning to visit a magic museum next month. It has a huge collection of props and memorabilia from famous magicians throughout history. I'm planning to visit a magic museum next month. It has a huge collection of props and memorabilia from famous magicians throughout history. I'm planning to visit a magic museum next month. It has a huge collection of props and memorabilia from famous magicians throughout history. Can you guess how magicians make objects disappear or appear out of thin air? I think it has something to do with misdirection and distraction. Can you guess how magicians make objects disappear or appear out of thin air? I think it has something to do with misdirection and distraction. Can you guess how magicians make objects disappear or appear out of thin air? I think it has something to do with misdirection and distraction. Can you guess how magicians make objects disappear or appear out of thin air? I think it has something to do with misdirection and distraction. What's the most expensive magic trick you've ever seen? I saw a magician make a Ferrari disappear once, and it was worth millions. What's the most expensive magic trick you've ever seen? I saw a magician make a Ferrari disappear once, and it was worth millions. What's the most expensive magic trick you've ever seen? I saw a magician make a Ferrari disappear once, and it was worth millions. What's the most expensive magic trick you've ever seen? I saw a magician make a Ferrari disappear once, and it was worth millions. I've always wondered how magicians choose their assistants. Do they have to undergo special training? I think some assistants are trained professionals, while others are just volunteers from the audience. 
I've always wondered how magicians choose their assistants. Do they have to undergo special training? I think some assistants are trained professionals, while others are just volunteers from the audience. I've always wondered how magicians choose their assistants. Do they have to undergo special training? I think some assistants are trained professionals, while others are just volunteers from the audience. I've always wondered how magicians choose their assistants. Do they have to undergo special training? I think some assistants are trained professionals, while others are just volunteers from the audience. Have you heard of the famous escape artist Harry Houdini? He was one of the most legendary magicians of all time. Have you heard of the famous escape artist Harry Houdini? He was one of the most legendary magicians of all time. Have you heard of the famous escape artist Harry Houdini? He was one of the most legendary magicians of all time. Have you heard of the famous escape artist Harry Houdini? He was one of the most legendary magicians of all time. I'm working on perfecting my close up magic skills. It's a great way to interact with people and create a sense of wonder. I'm working on perfecting my close up magic skills. It's a great way to interact with people and create a sense of wonder. I'm working on perfecting my close up magic skills. It's a great way to interact with people and create a sense of wonder. I'm working on perfecting my close up magic skills. It's a great way to interact with people and create a sense of wonder. Do you think magic tricks are more impressive when performed in a grand stage production or in a more intimate setting? Do you think magic tricks are more impressive when performed in a grand stage production or in a more intimate setting? Do you think magic tricks are more impressive when performed in a grand stage production or in a more intimate setting? Do you think magic tricks are more impressive when performed in a grand stage production or in a more intimate setting? I saw a magician use fire in his trick once, and it was both exciting and nerve wracking at the same time. I saw a magician use fire in his trick once, and it was both exciting and nerve wracking at the same time. I saw a magician use fire in his trick once, and it was both exciting and nerve wracking at the same time. I saw a magician use fire in his trick once, and it was both exciting and nerve wracking at the same time. How do you think magicians are able to read people's minds? I think it's all about being able to read people's body language and subtle cues. How do you think magicians are able to read people's minds? I think it's all about being able to read people's body language and subtle cues. How do you think magicians are able to read people's minds? I think it's all about being able to read people's body language and subtle cues. How do you think magicians are able to read people's minds? I think it's all about being able to read people's body language and subtle cues. I'm attending a magic convention next month. It's a great opportunity to meet other magicians and learn new tricks. I'm attending a magic convention next month. It's a great opportunity to meet other magicians and learn new tricks. I'm attending a magic convention next month. It's a great opportunity to meet other magicians and learn new tricks.
I'm attending a magic convention next month. It's a great opportunity to meet other magicians and learn new tricks. What's your favorite type of magic trick music? I love the classic, mysterious sound of a haunting melody on a piano. What's your favorite type of magic trick music? I love the classic, mysterious sound of a haunting melody on a piano. What's your favorite type of magic trick music? I love the classic, mysterious sound of a haunting melody on a piano. What's your favorite type of magic trick music? I love the classic, mysterious sound of a haunting melody on a piano. I'm watching a video on how to perform a magic trick with coins. It's amazing how simple household items can be transformed into a magic prop. I'm watching a video on how to perform a magic trick with coins. It's amazing how simple household items can be transformed into a magic prop. I'm watching a video on how to perform a magic trick with coins. It's amazing how simple household items can be transformed into a magic prop. I'm watching a video on how to perform a magic trick with coins. It's amazing how simple household items can be transformed into a magic prop. I heard that some magicians have secret societies where they share tips and tricks with each other. It's like a brotherhood of magicians. I heard that some magicians have secret societies where they share tips and tricks with each other. It's like a brotherhood of magicians. I heard that some magicians have secret societies where they share tips and tricks with each other. It's like a brotherhood of magicians. I heard that some magicians have secret societies where they share tips and tricks with each other. It's like a brotherhood of magicians. Have you ever watched a magic trick fail? It can be both awkward and hilarious at the same time. Have you ever watched a magic trick fail? It can be both awkward and hilarious at the same time. Have you ever watched a magic trick fail? It can be both awkward and hilarious at the same time. Have you ever watched a magic trick fail? It can be both awkward and hilarious at the same time. I'm trying to learn a new magic trick to impress my friends. Any recommendations on a good one? I'm trying to learn a new magic trick to impress my friends. Any recommendations on a good one? I'm trying to learn a new magic trick to impress my friends. Any recommendations on a good one? I'm trying to learn a new magic trick to impress my friends. Any recommendations on a good one? What's the most creative or original magic trick you've ever seen? I saw a magician turn a goldfish into a bird once, and it was incredible. What's the most creative or original magic trick you've ever seen? I saw a magician turn a goldfish into a bird once. And it was incredible. What's the most creative or original magic trick you've ever seen? I saw a magician turn a goldfish into a bird once, and it was incredible. What's the most creative or original magic trick you've ever seen? I saw a magician turn a goldfish into a bird once, and it was incredible. I think magic tricks are a great way to spark children's imaginations and get them interested in science and technology. 
I think magic tricks are a great way to spark children's imaginations and get them interested in science and technology. I think magic tricks are a great way to spark children's imaginations and get them interested in science and technology. I think magic tricks are a great way to spark children's imaginations and get them interested in science and technology. I'm practicing a new levitation trick. It's a difficult one, but I think I'm getting the hang of it. I'm practicing a new levitation trick. It's a difficult one, but I think I'm getting the hang of it. I'm practicing a new levitation trick. It's a difficult one, but I think I'm getting the hang of it. I'm practicing a new levitation trick. It's a difficult one, but I think I'm getting the hang of it. Have you ever heard of a one-man show magic performance? It's when a magician performs solo and incorporates storytelling into his tricks. Have you ever heard of a one-man show magic performance? It's when a magician performs solo and incorporates storytelling into his tricks. Have you ever heard of a one-man show magic performance? It's when a magician performs solo and incorporates storytelling into his tricks. Have you ever heard of a one-man show magic performance? It's when a magician performs solo and incorporates storytelling into his tricks. What's the most complex or intricate magic trick you've ever seen? I saw a magician make a train disappear once, and it involved a lot of coordination and timing. What's the most complex or intricate magic trick you've ever seen? I saw a magician make a train disappear once, and it involved a lot of coordination and timing. What's the most complex or intricate magic trick you've ever seen? I saw a magician make a train disappear once, and it involved a lot of coordination and timing. What's the most complex or intricate magic trick you've ever seen? I saw a magician make a train disappear once, and it involved a lot of coordination and timing. I'm watching a documentary on the life of magician Ricky Jay. He was one of the most talented and eccentric magicians of all time. I'm watching a documentary on the life of magician Ricky Jay. He was one of the most talented and eccentric magicians of all time. I'm watching a documentary on the life of magician Ricky Jay. He was one of the most talented and eccentric magicians of all time. I'm watching a documentary on the life of magician Ricky Jay. He was one of the most talented and eccentric magicians of all time. Do you think magic tricks are becoming more or less popular over time? I think they're still popular especially with the rise of social media and viral videos. Do you think magic tricks are becoming more or less popular over time? I think they're still popular, especially with the rise of social media and viral videos. Do you think magic tricks are becoming more or less popular over time? I think they're still popular, especially with the rise of social media and viral videos. Do you think magic tricks are becoming more or less popular over time? I think they're still popular, especially with the rise of social media and viral videos. I'm attending a magic-themed party this weekend. I'm excited to see all the creative costumes and performances. I'm attending a magic-themed party this weekend. I'm excited to see all the creative costumes and performances. 
I'm attending a magic-themed party this weekend. I'm excited to see all the creative costumes and performances. I'm attending a magic-themed party this weekend. I'm excited to see all the creative costumes and performances. Hope you enjoyed today's video. Leave a comment below if you found any content challenging and share your thoughts with other learners. Subscribe, like, and share this video to support us and stay up to date on new courses. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you again soon.